it's sunny and a little bit rainy and 45. That's why my nipples are hard. <laughs> Actually wore a bra today. Um, so we we decided on Wednesday that we we're gonna fly out to New Hampshire because Ariel still had um, a ticket left over. So basically we got to the airport and it was a shit show. We were so late. We were like literally sprinting all around. The airport is the most cardio I've done all year long. I have shin splints from it. Uh, but we ended up making our flight. It's just that this damn bus, this guy was like driving so slow to get us from one side of the airport to the next. But we ended up making it. We get to Boston. Um, I mean, what what else happened? We didn't do anything last night, really. It was hard as hell to go to sleep because we're on LA time. We explored the north end, not really. We literally just ate pizza and stayed inside. In Little Italy. Oh, it was very, gelato. very, very cute. It looked like the Sweet Life of Zach and Cody. We did get gelato. We had some really bomb ass pizza, honestly. Um, I had a bit of a mental breakdown last night for like half an hour, but it was fine. <laughs> Anyways, um, now it's raining. We're in Salem. We walk up to like this witch museum that we're about to go to and like found out that we have to order everything online, but all of our phones are on like 3% for no reason. <laughs> about to go do some witchy things, <laughs> spooky season things. I said earlier that I was having like a bit of anxiety and like shut down for a couple hours, but honestly we played a little bit of like Katy Perry, I kissed a girl and now like I'm back in action, ready to roll. Literally all, all it took, I just want to make out with bitches well, and do some was spooky Britney things. Spears toxic. Bitch, you're toxic. You're toxic. <laughs> A little bit. <laughs> said Bro, I it looks, to like, it looks like one of those fucking hats. <laughs> I'm just like, boom. I told you I need to check the size, and you were like, it's fine. I was like, okay. I'm stuck a bit. Look, look, look. <laughs> hey, yo, we out here in fucking Witch Town. My mind immediately reverts to sex every time when I'm lost and don't know what to do. <laughs> Will I have sex tonight? Very likely, that's lit. Guys, I just got a psychic reading. Uh, he did like a tarot card thing. He told me to pick a number, but he ended up pulling out 10 cards just cause like he felt like it was right. And the top card was <laughs> the divine male. Basically he told me I had daddy issues and that my my heart is cold because of it and um, that I need that I've tried to fix the relationship but it's it's past the point of being fixed but to fix my heart I have to have really good sex. That's exactly what he told me. He was like you need to have really good sex to make your heart not be cold anymore and I was like that's a fact. Man's a genius. <laughs> He's gonna tell me the same fucking thing. He was just like, you need to have so good sex. So that means he hasn't had good sex? I guarantee, so I guarantee never you. Had good sex. Guarantee he said you. we- Boy was just trying to smack. <laughs> Honestly, he kept telling me he was pretty young. Lay down in the grass and take a little cat nap because that just sounds really bomb right now. You, you wanna tell him what we're doing? So we're gonna blow up some, some cars from the salvage yard if you can go over there. You can kind of see it. Yeah, we're at Ariel's house out here in New Hampshire, and um, she owns the salvage yard. And yeah, we're just gonna blow up some cars today, get some content for arson, um, and you know, do some hood rat shit. <laughs> All right, it's been like two hours. Leslie's still laying out in this like field. Should we check on her? Hey, you good? Yeah, man, I'm just photosynthesizing. <laughs> photosynthesizing. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this wild ass dog right here. Yes, bitch! If this went off right now, how big would the explosion be? Well, we'd be dead. <laughs> <laughs> and it would catch these cars on fire and it would probably blow off three quarters of the house. Of the house. Let's see. 
What is fucking happening? Um, right so now? we just tried to put like a little bit of gas on the top of the car just to, you know, like get a string of it. But I, in my head, I was thinking lighter fluid because that shit just like burns and then goes out. We used gas and the entire car caught on fire. We're out. At this point, I don't even know if I want to blow anything up. No, we're not definitely not blowing anything up. That can't generate. If we don't have anything to blow up, yeah. The guy came out that works for my grandfather and he was like, you guys like some milk? Careful you don't catch that on fire, there's like grease all up in that tractor. Catches that on fire, he's gonna blow up. Yeah, I like got out of the way, I thought it was a... What are we doing today? Do you want you want to like camera? Um <clears throat> <laughs> Today, we're gonna uh, go blow some shit up because we were supposed to blow up the cop car and it ended up catching completely on fire and we had to basically bury it in the dirt to put it out. Um, so I guess we're gonna go grab a random car out there. Did y'all find another cop car? Blowing well, up the same one. Oh, are we, we're blowing same up one. the one that's completely crushed and yeah, doesn't I, even look like a car anymore? I think we're gonna finish it off. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Like lean to get on it, but I just like just don't trust myself. No. What do you mean? I'm gonna well, lean Don't do that. No. <laughs> it's such a far gap. Step. You can literally do it in one step. I know I can't. Your legs are so much longer than mine. I'm literally 5'3. Damn, that thing's still bad. Holy shit. So, well, I see you got them snakes and sparklers, but where's good stuff, man? Good stuff. This is the good stuff. Snakes and sparklers. Are you nuts, dude? You need stuff to explode. Go boom. Why is that good? Why is the sunset good? Why are boobs good? You shove them up bullfrog's ass. I know, lighter. but <laughs> I guess I have to like literally hold it like this. Sure. <laughs> are you ready? <laughs> Wait, where's Ryan? Ryan! <laughs> Shove them up bullfrog's ass. That this stops. Does it? Yeah. No, they literally called me out. Like, I'm not gonna go out like a bitch. They started calling him King Ding. 